Life is a winding road. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. Um, so today we are doing a reset of our house. We do this on Sundays typically, and we've done it for years, years and years now. Um, you guys asked us about our daily life here in Korea. You said that was more of what you wanted to see. So that's why we are showing you our reset. This is a typical yeah. Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening. Yep, so we are both starting back to school this week. This week Caleb has his students at um, his school in person. And then I actually am starting master's classes. So we really wanted to get back into that normal routine that we have really been craving, <laughs> honestly. And a Sunday reset is kind of the perfect way to do that. And we're gonna show you what that looks like here at our apartment in Korea. All right, we are getting ready for the week. We're kind of cleaning up from the weekend. We can't take um, our garbage or recycling to the curb on the weekend. And we got a grocery order. So that kind of stacked up some work for us and we've got some things to take out tonight and then we're also going to do a little bit of meal prep and kind of clean things up in the kitchen. So that'll be kind of my primary roles as we reset. That's a big adjustment living here. We do not have a dishwasher so everything is by hand. So that's a major difference. It was a very nice luxury that we had gotten used to and uh, are still not fully adjusted to washing or anything really by hand. Know, really wanna know If I Let me figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high even if the sky is falling down. I pretty much finished with the dishes. So now I am going to move on here. So now I am going to roast some chickpeas to have as a snack. All right, now that I am all showered and ready, I can start helping <laughs> with the whole house reset. And so I'm going to tackle our bedroom, but mostly like specifically the laundry um, because it has piled up as it always does. <laughs> and um, there's actually a load in the dryer and in the washer that has been in there for days that I finally need to just like bite the bullet, and get it done. So high, trust in our wings to fly. Sometimes we're crashing down. All right, so now that we're finished, mostly with the, what what we can so far, anyways, with the kitchen and the laundry, um, we're going to start working on the other rooms. And so one of us is gonna dust, the other one's going to wipe surfaces, and then. One of us is going to vacuum, vacuum. Yeah. and then the next one, the other one of us is going to mop so we can just like get done with the room very, very fast. <laughs> right. So how did these Sunday resets come about? Do you remember how it all kind of came about? No. So she was working so with 4-H uh, and so she'd be gone a lot on nights and I was coaching so yeah. I'd be out a lot on nights. And so we started using Sundays to meal prep for the week and kind of reset and mm -hmm. then just kind of generally Maintain keep maintenance throughout the, week. throughout the week and then resetting mm -hmm. on Sunday evenings. Yeah. And that was the first two years of our marriage and we've kind of kept it ever since, mm -hmm. but it was more a necessity mm -hmm. at that point. But that's kind of how it started. Yeah. And since both of us are going back to school this week, um, it's going to kind of be like... Right. A, It'll be important to be back in that. Yeah, a catalyst for us to like feel good and like have some motivation going into the week, so. If I let figure out where the road goes 
Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. You can say I lost my mind. I will keep on holding my head. All right, just like that, living room is complete. So now, whoop. Now, what are we doing now, Caleb? Uh, bedroom. Bedroom. Our bedroom is next. So, this is what it looks like. It's not terrible. There's some clutter up there we need to get rid of and on their nightstands and stuff. But, pretty much the same thing. Dust, wipe, vacuum, mop. Good to go. The room is nice and clean. Still have hangers for the rest of the laundry. I don't know where to put our humidifier, <laughs> but nice and reset. Feels good. One more main room, spare bedroom. Right. Um, probably won't take very long either. No. Um, I wasn't planning on doing the bathroom. I don't know about you, That's but fine. it's all wet and stuff from us showering. It takes forever to dry out, and it's hard to clean that way. So I'll probably just do that tomorrow. Yeah. Laundry is still running. There's still some dishes, um, but. If that's we take like out laundry normal. and dishes, this whole process, Is 30 that? minutes, yeah. 40 minutes tops, mm -hmm. yeah. um, it's just a good way. And then we maintain it throughout the week. We haven't been doing that, that's why this yeah, reset but... <laughs> was a little more intensive. Yeah, I was going to say that normal. actually, so I'm glad you oh, said okay. that. No, you're good. <laughs> so yeah, this, today's re this week's reset, definitely a more intensive process because we haven't been keeping up with it. Um, and so... We'll get back into maintaining throughout the week, and hopefully these Sunday resets won't be near us. So they can even shorten down to maybe 20 minutes. Yeah, so. the big, the biggest add-on to these Sunday resets is washing the dishes by hand, right. Right. and then sometimes our dryer doesn't dry our clothes all the way, and so we have to hang, right? Finish hang, finish drying our clothes by hang drying them and that makes the process longer so right yeah but we just have one more room to go yeah. p.s if you guys want us to send you a postcard from korea uh, make sure to follow us on instagram I'll put it down here below but it's at caleb and mo and we'll send you guys a card um dm us with your address on instagram and if you've got kids, I'm sure that they'd love to see some, a card or something like this coming from Korea. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And we are Done with the reset of our house. Um, I mean, like we already said, laundry and rest of the kitchen will finish that um, as we can. And then, I don't know what else we're gonna do today. What else do we usually do on a reset day? I mean, those are the major things. Just add some folding pops up, a few more dishes here and there, and just kind of kick it and rest now usually we go over each other's schedule mm. too um just to be on the same page and we wanted to um thank you guys for watching this video and if you thought we got out of uh house cleaning by moving to korea no. surprise yep we and didn't <laughs> You're so you you're surprised at how easily you fall into like just a regular everyday normal routine like like you would anywhere like you have the same kind of chores the same kind of tasks you're just in a different country <laughs> right nothing magical is going on no <laughs> um we asked you guys on Instagram what kind of content you would like us to start 
posting in 2022 on the youtube channel and a lot of you said just like life in korea so that's why we did this whole reset video um and we're gonna do so we've got some other ideas but if you have anything specifically that you want to see that's different um tell us here, down below in the comments yes tell us down below in the comments let us know what kind of content you would like to see and make sure to subscribe 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 please share our channel with your friends um tell them to subscribe um because it really does help us grow so all right hope you guys have a great week and a great day bye even if i'm falling down i will keep on searching for my highs Say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down